the APS are to my line. So, I mean, uh, all those eight officers that uh, Khmer speak, and they pretty much fluent in both languages. Khmer That's Khmer. correct. Yeah, they speak English and Khmer. And uh, the next question to you is, um, if someone doesn't speak a any English at all, um, if they want to report a crime, I mean, uh, they better off have someone go with them to the police station or have someone else call and have the officer come to where it happened? Well, it, it would depend on the situation. If we have a Khmer speaking a person on duty at the time, then that would be obviously the best situation. Uh, typically we do. We also have Khmer speaking dispatchers and civilian employees in the police department. So there's typically always someone on duty who can speak the language. But there would be occasion that you would, might need someone to, uh, who speaks English and Khmer interpret for the person who can only speak Khmer. And what was the best way to do? I mean, they uh, rather have the police come to the. You can do it either way. You you can have a police officer come to the home where the person is, or they can come to the police station. It doesn't matter. If the police officer comes to the home and they need someone to interpret, they can call for one of the uh, Cambodian officers to come and assist. Uh, if not, if not available, then someone who speaks English and Khmer can help them. Also, just some other uh, Chief uh, uh, Lavali, please uh, some join to sub mode like nine seven eight six five four six three five zero. We are here live with the Chief uh, of Law Police. If anyone of you uh, watching would like to ask any question, uh, feel free to call at nine seven eight six five four six three five zero. ធ្វើដែលសំណុំរឿងពាក់ព័ន្ធរឿងអ្វីក៏ដល់ប្រយោជន៍ចង់មានបលិសមកធ្វើរីភោតយើងអាចហៅបលិសមកផ្ទះយ
but the other side, the other party should have called to confirm with me to make sure that I approve my son to stay with that, that family. I, I agree with that. Yeah. That, w that would seem to be the, the common sense approach. Mm -hmm. However, you know, there may not be something illicit or illegal going on. That the, again, there has to be some type of investigation conducted before someone can make a determination whether something was illegal or not. Yeah. Okay, yeah. The next question is, um, let me say that uh, uh, um, uh, 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 in command. Some of the topics the อ่าไว้ก็เอาบ่ยิงใหญ่รวมคือยิงจะชนรงครัวอ่าโดยอําเภอหังษาครองครัวษาก็ยิงมีสิทธิ์ uh, next question is uh, for those uh, people that are illegally in this country illegally yeah and um, if they are the victim of any crime mm -hmm. and they are willing, I mean, they want to report uh, the, the crime. And yes. Uh, a lot of people, they uh, hesitate to report it and a lot of people, right. they, they don't want to deal with the police because they know that they're legal. I understand. But they are the, uh, the real victim of a certain crime. Right. And can they report uh, to the police without any uh, immigration involvement? Such so, uh, domestic, for example. Yeah. The low police department is not interested in someone's immigration status when they're a victim. We're, we're there to protect the victim from an aggressor. We're not doing immigration enforcement. We're not enforcing the immigration laws. That's the job of the federal government. Now, that being said, sometimes we do work with ICE to enforce immigration laws in the city of Lowell. However, we're not trying to impact people who are victims of crimes, just the opposite. We're trying to find the people who are illegal, who are the predators, the people who are committing crimes on a regular basis, because they shouldn't be here. <laughs> អរិយការប្រាប់ប្រលេសហើយគេមិនសួរនាំពីដែលថាយើងមានសិទ្ធិនៅឬអត់ទេហើយរឿងម្យ៉ាងទៀតដែលថាដែលគេធ្វើការជ
Uh, uh, there's a question that. Uh, go ahead. Kawai, the question is based on the uh, traffic uh, violation. Mm -hmm. uh, that people rush in the rush hours, we got off from work, and the police uh, spot uh, near the traffic uh, uh, traffic lights, and then people like. They they travel pass through the green, then the the light turn yellow, but they in in they couldn't stop, so they proceed, and they receive a ticket. Is that uh, uh is that the uh, they can go and ask to forgive for that or? Well, I, I'm 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 wondering if the person is referring to gridlock. If you're approaching an intersection, particularly during rush hour, and you proceed into the intersection, but you cannot make it through. It is illegal. You've just gridlocked the intersection, and that you can be fined for that. Okay. So, so the best thing is uh, when it's a rush hour, it's a gridlock. They have to stop where the. Um, if the, you see the, the car ahead of you is yeah. stopped and yeah. is not moving, yeah. you can't proceed. Exactly, you yeah. can't proceed yeah. into the intersection, and then because what happens is the light turns green for the other people, uh -huh. they can't move because you've blocked the intersection and it creates traffic backups in both directions. Yeah. But you can appeal back to court. ហើយខ្ញុំដឹងតាឡានោះពីមុខដែរប៉ុន្តែវាហួសភ្លើងលឿនតិចតែខ្ញុំអាចនៅត្រង់ឡើងនោះវិស្ទេសរាចរណ
kì chạp bởi chìa một phút đi bởi dương chăm bọt chuê dương chăm nó ạc hằng đang nó ạc xài ạc xài xo để kì kì ôi chôm nâng dương chôm chăm bọt chuê có mọi dương liên một phút mà làn thì liên máu bê nà dương bọt ạc cao có kì chạp dương đại chăm ôi xa lạc chăm dương rù đồng một cái bọt bởi đời he just want to clarify that to make sure that the travelers are reduce the speed and don't proceed when when the traffic ahead of, of them. Correct. To make sure they stay That's behind. right. So yes. So that won't cause this kind of friction. That's right. Uh, Chief, well, thank you very much. I know the time is short and I mentioned that the, the I, I look at the survey from the police department very, very thorough and details and it's very interesting and, and I hope uh, other people who would like to know you can log into uh, uh, WW Law Police Department uh, low.org, I think, or you can just Google low police department low mass. Mm -hmm. You can see the whole police report, and it's very interesting. And you can wait and read it, and you can raise questions when uh, my police officers come to our shows when they are available, which is very, very important. I'll make that happen. Yeah, thank you, Chief. Thank and, you. And uh, I would like to thank to all, every one of you. And I wish that there's some callers beside the community call and ask different questions to the Chief. It's very rare to have Chief appear on a live show. Uh, thank you very much. And uh, we hope to Thank see you. you again next week. And Chief, we hope to see you again some other time. Sure. In a, in, in a better time. So hopefully we get the whole an hour and a half for you. And we can more question. And uh you know more than look half run uh the uh the look on the Chief, we would like to thank and thank you very much and have a good night and hope uh, you enjoy the nice weather that we have today and tomorrow and the whole week. I think it's very, very, uh, very nice weather we have. Oh yes, without a doubt. I hope we don't have any more issues <laughs> with, with nice weather, tend to have a lot of issues. You know, oh, I understand, yeah, have, right. I else. appreciate that, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, good night. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.
Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn